and pressured Canelo turns into a seek and destroy warrior. We believe that will be the game plan for the Turkish Wolf. 12 rounds for the unified suit. The fight. Left hook lands and already moves it. So yes, it is a punch that will be there. Shit. Right on the belt line goes Canelo and again with the right hand. Puts pressure in there. Maybe this is the strategy that they're implementing. Yeah, part of the reason he's called, or was called, Mr. Robot, is that he keeps that guard, guard really high. Part of their plan, they're not going to throw it if they know something big's coming back. A lot of power shots, almost 15 per round, according to CompuBox. Nice uppercut with the right hand for Canelo. That's one of them. Anthony Durrell landed 43% of his power punches. Chris Eubank. You think that's an early game plan or just something he's learning on the fly that those are the punches that are landing? No. We, don't, we do know Yildrim is very tough, has a lot of heart. How much longer can he stick around if he just keeps absorbing all these uppercuts and body shots? That was a vicious left hook. Just standing right in the middle of the ring. Not much move comes up. Really aggressive and puts the pressure. But if this is the game plan, you gotta at least give him credit for being patient. I'm not sure Yildrum has landed one significant power punch yet. Canelo, on the other hand, does it. Those are vicious body punches. Even though Yildrum's blocking those shots, believe me. Oh! 10 years with James Kirkland into the third round. Can he beat it tonight? He senses the end. Downstairs, upstairs. Yildrum not firing back. Look at Canelo just piecing him apart. There's a count. Any kind of resistance from Yildrum. No offense. Maybe he needs to turn back into Mr. Robot. Yes, he does. Maybe he does. Stopped the fight. It's over.